What is going on everybody? Wait a minute! Who are you? My name is Mike. This is Wall Street Traders where we break down hot trading stocks to put you at advantage on the market. Nice. Right, so today's ticker symbol that we're breaking down is TSLA or Tesla. Uh, I have my lines and graphs already set you guys. We're starting at a higher time frame so we can see the overall direction and picture that our stock is in. We don't trade in a vacuum you guys. We apply this knowledge that knowledge knowledge that we have to give us an advantage when trading so uh i'm gonna go ahead and start with where we left off on friday so on friday we gapped up into major re uh, minor resistance if we look to our left we see all these candlesticks in this area and the candlesticks in this area and then over here all the way to our left so we always look left like beyonce says to get prior information you guys so and our support is down here and we can test this we see these candlesticks that came down tested this area three candlesticks here we have a uh, hammer stick candlestick here one right here and then these ones over here and we have three on the opposite side. The opposite side works as resistance. On, on top, it works as a floor, you guys. So down here, we had these candlesticks hitting resistance. So if we follow it along, we had resistance. Uh, we tested it twice, gapped up, came back down, pulled back onto our new floor, our support, and tested twice, and then bounced all the way up into our $900 area where we tested our resistance so this is now our resistance level that's been tested how do we do this well we see this candlestick here these three in this area these two here and this one here and ultimately every time it hit this area there was either a bounce or a rejection so we see it came up here rejected consolidated came back up retested our resistance pulled all the way back down and did this twice until it ultimately failed all the way back down to look to our left prior uh support so this is our major support this is our major resistance so we see it came down it kind of peekabooed below which is fine but we have minor right here minor resistance here we could test that but ultimately it came back up broke our downtrend this is why i have this line here to show that the trend that we were in previously we broke this trend and now we created a higher low which is always a good sign and uh tested our support and now that we see our is now creating a reversal the only problem that i see as of right now is we look to our left we have this minor resistance so for further confirmation you guys further confirmation that if you are not an aggressive trader and you're a safer trader what i would do is potentially just wait before getting in what we want to see is this break passes uh minor resistance we want to see further information showing that buyers are stepping up and not getting in too early because what could happen is we could hit this minor resistance end up pulling back down to our support level down here so what we want to see is is break our uh minor resistance here come up and come back down and test this new floor so you got to think of it as channel guys like once we break into channels you know wait for further confirmation in the direction that we're going um so this will prevent you from getting into something as of right now and then it pulled back and then you're uh you know don't have any other money to buy into on this dip so that's why it's always good to use technical analysis you guys uh, so as of right now, like I said, uh, if it does end up just getting rejected and pulling back down to this area, this would also be another good entry area. You set your entry at the 608 or $600 area and then your, uh, your stop loss or your mental stop loss below that in the 586 to uh, protect your account, you guys, because the name of this game is also money management. Always protecting your portfolio um, is key. So because if it does break below this area, then our next level is back down here in the 450 460 area which i don't believe it'll, it'll go back down in that area but um it is possible that we will retest this support um if not guys what we're going to wait for is for a further confirmation for this to come up and come back down and test this new minor resistance in the 700 dollars area uh so i just wanted to make this video fairly quickly just to show you guys my opinion and uh where i think we're currently at uh so if you guys like these videos that i that i create hit that like button that subscribe button and drop some stocks below that i can break down for you guys and other than that you guys have a happy sunday and a happy easter